Alrighty, guys. What is going on? I just got back from Mexico. Uh, I've been back a total of... There's like 24... A little over 24 hours. Anyways. So, I had enough footage before I left to basically get up until Sunday. Today's the 6th, so until the 6th. So, officially back from Mexico, I need to get to recording some more Let's Go. Uh, but first, I kind of wanted to go over what happened while I was in Mexico. So, I did have some downtime, uh, which allowed me to do a little bit of shiny hunting. And, of course, if you guys are at all interested in seeing that footage, uh, all of that stuff is... Uh, recorded directly from my switch and posted straight to Twitter so I would just kind of briefly show you guys what we've got here so we did catch a shiny Bulbasaur I did get a near perfect IV Bulbasaur though um, it looks to be like that special defense is probably like a 29 or a 30 next we're gonna look at our wonderful shiny Rhyhorn I did go ahead and get a very good uh, set of IVs on another Rhyhorn. And uh, if you guys followed on Twitter, I do have quite a few candies for Rhyhorn that we're actually going to spend today. The surprise of all of my trip in Mexico, as far as Let's Go goes, uh, is <laughs> a shiny Kangaskhan. Uh, other than that, that is, uh, I think, all the shinies that I did encounter except for one Pidgey which of course I did let run away because I hate Pidgeys. Uh, I was going for shiny Squirtle but I was literally getting one spawn like every hour and I got up to like eight or nine on the catch combo and one of them ran from me. I was very upset so I gave up. Uh, that was the last thing that I ended up doing was the shiny Squirtle hunt and I didn't get very far on it. So in total We've got Shiny Bulbasaur, Shiny Pidgeot, Shiny Rattata, which is ready to be evolved, Shiny Pikachu, which, dude, level 75, holy cow, this thing levels so freaking fast. We have a Shiny Rhyhorn, and we have a Shiny Kangaskhan. Now, as far as where we are, uh, so I did beat Koga, and uh, I definitely need to set my party back up here really fast. Another thing that I forgot to uh, mention is... <clears throat> So, I did have uh, two Charizards and two Venusaurs. Um, so, I ended up using... Remember those high IV um, Charizard, or Charmander and Bulbasaur that we got? Yeah, basically, I ended up ditching the old uh, Venusaur um, for the better IV one, which kind of sucks now that I have an even better IV one ready to go. Uh, but I did the same with Charizard as well. Basically, the Charizard... This Charizard is horrible IVs. This Charizard actually has decent ones. So I, I ended up just training it up and, you know, basically I tried to have the same moveset. I'm pretty sure I don't. But something at least close. So let me go ahead and add these to the party really fast. And I think that is actually everything that happened while I was gone. So what do we do from here? Um, so we've beaten Koga. We should go south towards Cinnabar Island if I'm not mistaken but I don't have a way to traverse water so that's gonna be interesting how am I gonna do that I don't know okay here's some Dodrio I haven't caught Dodrio yet so or uh Doduo don't hold that against me it's been a while okay bird keeper Wilton without a bird in his cage uh, I guess the perks of shiny hunting over these last few weeks has granted me with some really high level Pokemon uh, and I thought about like trying to hold off and instead of like leveling up all these Pokemon and having just a huge advantage um, I thought about like trying to switch that up but I really was just like nah, screw that we're just gonna go for it so most of the rest of the uh, actual storyline should be a cakewalk as long as I can uh, type everything correctly, which have faith guys, I'm not an idiot. Basically, once I hit level 60, uh, basically I was 
so when I first started leveling everything up, I was like, alright, I'm just gonna get to level 50 because then anything past level 50 is just gonna make this game, like, too easy for me. So, I got to level 50, and then I was like, you know what, screw that. Let's just, if we're gonna do it, we're gonna do it. Let's just go for it. So, I got to level 50, and then everything started to kind of taper off and then I got all of the evolutions ready and I was like well I have nothing else to do so I don't want to evolve anything without you guys being able to see it so I just went okay let's go to level 60 I got to level 60 on all of my Pokemon and basically my entire team which I do have currently uh, set up here my entire party was at level 60 so after that I was like well if I go any higher I'm just gonna kind of like be stuck with really high level Pokemon so I did it anyways, but the Pikachu started at level 60, just like all of the other Pokemon, except Pikachu is level 75, and everything else is level 68, I think, uh, yeah, 68, I mean, like, it's just insane, like, I don't understand how, how, like, that Pikachu levels so much faster. You want to be on camera? Is that what it is? You want to be on camera? Say hi. Say hi to YouTube. Say hello. Say hello. Yeah, you just want me to pay you. I know. I know. We need to get to, uh... Uh... Cinnabar Island. That's what I was thinking of. What? Why am I flying so high? This has never happened before! What in the world? Okay, we're just gonna roll with it. Whoa. Why are all these Pokemon like... How do I get down? Uh. Okay, that was interesting. Picnicker Misaki. Sounds like she's a top into a sandwich. Or some type of sauce so this route is just gonna take me right back to Celadon City which doesn't make a whole lot of sense how do I get surf people somebody please tell me before I have to look it up Pokemon Road the Susan isn't it huh oh sorry I spaced out I'm a coach trainer did you want to have a battle okay I'm ready Hey, there's a Pokeball right there. Why didn't you guys tell me there's a Pokeball before I freaking started a stupid battle with Grantly? Coach Trainer Grantly! I'm telling you, they have run out of names. They are out of names completely. It looked like it said Victory Bell. So I'm hoping that it was Victory Bell. Beedrill, no! I should actually find out if, uh, is Sand True exclusive to Let's Go Pikachu? Is that one of the ones? I can't remember. Uh, because if so, I want a shiny Sand Slash. That would be, like, an amazing find. Punk Guy Cory! Such a rebel, rebellious, re re rebellious, rebellious? Cory is such a rebellious name. All right, I'm gonna say it, okay? I'm gonna say it. I don't like how Nintendo is preying on the nostalgia. I agree with that. Everybody says that, but I wholeheartedly agree with it. But damn it, if these freaking Gen 1 Pokemon aren't cool, I don't know what is, okay? I'm just gonna say it. I like Gen 1, okay? I love Gen 1. 
I think I like Gen 2 a little bit more. But I like Gen 1, okay? Poke well up there. Hey, okay. Okay, okay, guys. Okay. Okay. Alright. Okay. Okay. Alright. So. Okay. Okay. And. Okay. Let's take this slow. We don't need to rush this. Uh, yeah, that's fine. I don't necessarily think I need to be full health. Uh, so, um, Snorlax, uh, as you guys know, <laughs> did get away. And, uh, I, I need, I really, really, really need to catch this one. Like, I, I need to catch this. So bad. <sighs> okay. So we're going to use Eevee, fighting moves, to knock this thing dead. And then we're going to catch it. And I kind of want to use it on my team, but I don't, I don't have room. I don't want to take off Kadabra unless I can get... Unless unless Snorlax can learn some decent uh, 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 psychic moves. A Pokemon is sprawled out in deep and comfortable slumber. Do you want to use the Pug Flute? Yes. So beautiful. So beautiful. <laughs> Snorlax will go. Snorlax mistook you for the food and attacks. Alright. So let's do this. His defense rose. First thing. That sucks. Alright. I know you can do it. Yeah, you can. I know you can, Eevee. He's only level 34. You're going to kill this guy. Double kick. We only have five minutes. Let's go. Keep it going. Boom. Almost done. Boom. Literally. Almost done. We need, like, one more... Aw, oh, yawn. Great. Don't, don't, no, no. Oh, he's only, he's only drowsy. He's only drowsy. We got this. <clears throat> Double kick. All right. Let's catch this sucker. He's not getting away. He's not getting away this time, guys. He's big. He's fat. <sighs> Raspberry Ultra Ball incoming. Let's do this. Yes! Excellent throw. Come on. Come on. Woo! First throw. Beautiful. Beautiful. I totally, totally should have set that up for an evolution string. But it's all good. Because <laughs> we got it. Woo! Redemption! Feels great. Feels really, really, really great. He's a big fat Pokemon. That's what he sounds like. All right. Whew. That felt good. That felt really good. 